Welcome to Oz Nomad Destinations. Follow us as we caravan our way around Australia. This is Ed and I'm Beck, and we're finding you the best free and budget camp spots Oz has to offer. Fishing, crabbing and hiking our way through this awesome country. For notifications, click subscribe and hit the bell and that will keep you up to date. Hi, so yep, we're still in Bellingen. There's so much to do in this area, we've stayed a little longer. We've been packing lunch each day and doing day trips and today we're heading to Sawtell. What a gorgeous little town this is. We went because I wanted to swim in an ocean pool and I'm ticking that off my bucket list. You'll find the memorial pools at Bonville Heads Lookout. There's heaps of parking, a toilet to get changed in on site and a walking ramp down the hill to the pool. There is a shower and a foot wash near the pool, but there is no shade or seats. We went midweek as to avoid the crowds and it wasn't too hard to get in the pool, but I did feel it could do with one more step, but I managed. There was only about six people there and was totally enjoyable. Under the water, there's lots of little colorful fish and I wish I'd bought my goggles and snorkel but I have the worst memory. We also went for drive up the main street and grabbed an ice cream and lunch. Make sure you do that as well. It's got some really cute little shops. After lunch, we headed down to Yaranga Lagoon footbridge. It's the best boardwalk to date and stretches one kilometre out across the Kalang River. I think it's Kalang. Kalang River where it meets the Bellingen River and then flows out to sea. It's an easy walk but man was it windy the day we were there. There were heaps of stingrays and small fish getting around under the boardwalk and we loved how the builder had made steps down to the edge so you could fish or access the wetlands or swamp. It was surprising just how many people were using this boardwalk. The next day we headed to Nambucca Heads and we ran into these cute kids that just wanted to be on YouTube. I gave them my channel and so here you are kids on YouTube. We had lunch in the park in front of the biggest caravan park I've seen and then went for a walk out along the wall. It was very interesting seeing everyone's memories of their loved ones, trips and holidays and just general memories painted on the wall. current running out of this river was next level. Then we spotted a pot of dolphins playing in the current. We stood there for about 15 minutes watching them dart in and out of the current waves.
We followed the wall all the way to the end to Wellington Beach before turning around and heading back. We came across two travellers that were leaving their mark on the wall. Then we headed up to Captain Cook's lookout, a hill just behind the caravan park. Nambucca Heads is a pretty town surrounded by water and creeks, with the biggest caravan park. When we arrived back at Bellingen, it was really late and we decided it was a good night to dine out. So off to Zartar's we went, and it didn't disappoint. Ed had an egg and eggplant pastry, and I had hummus and mushrooms with a warm pitta. It was really delicious. So that's it for this week. Keep in contact, stay happy, and we'll see you next Sunday at 6am.